Hey you, do you want to win some free Robux? Well, I give away Robux every single day. To enter, like the video, subscribe to the channel, comment down below your Roblox username, and set up a please donate booth, and you'll be entered. So here we are right now inside of a dusty trip. In the latest update, they added the shops where we can buy and sell items. I'm going to be showing you the best items that you can sell inside of a dusty trip today that will give you the most bottle caps. There is some items that literally give... 20 bottle caps whereas normal items give one there's some items that give even more bottle caps guys so make sure you don't go anywhere as if you guys do you're gonna miss out on this crazy video um so i guess so far for everybody let's go on and go on into it now guys i guess so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna get this car sorted and i will um read out some of the best items to get and we'll see if we can find a few of these in the map so i'll meet you guys back once we're ready so guys a little tip when actually um getting well if you guys want to go in and get some of these bottle caps guys and sell a bunch of items i highly recommend to go in and attach a trailer to your car of course we have this normal trailer over here guys that is right at spawn that you guys can go ahead and attach because that will just allow you guys to carry so many more of these items that give a lot of bottle caps guys um instead of having to, like attach them to your car and stuff so guys let's just go ahead and get into the video right now on how you guys can get these bottle caps fast so pretty much guys there's nothing really in the start house that you, that's worth a bunch of bottle caps guys but i'm gonna be showing you what is so the first thing that is worth a lot of bottle caps guys so the default amount for, for items is literally just one bottle cap which is not much at all but um we have items such as okay i don't know what's going on over here guys such as the um the radioactive barrels now they give 20 bottle caps which is kind of crazy now the only downside about these radioactive barrels is that when you go ahead and come sell them guys you will um have well sorry when you come to pick them up you will have that annoying radioactive effect on you which will last throughout the whole game unless you die and respawn so yeah that's a i guess if you if you if you don't really mind the radioactive effect then you can pick up a bunch of those and sell them because you get 20 per barrel which is absolutely crazy guys um so that's one of them the next one is a rubber duck now this gives you guys 15 this can spawn in any building except the start house guys and it's just simply a rubber duck it's worth 15 barrels um sorry 15 bottle caps which is really really cool guys it looks like we're coming over here to a house actually i think this is a shop yeah it's a shop um which is kind of cool guys I'm, i mean if you need to we can come back over there um okay guys so yeah there's two high um valued items right there let's go and move on into some more guys so pretty much what else can you guys go ahead and sell for a lot well guys the keyboard the keyboard is worth 11 bottle caps which is a lot guys and of course this can spawn in any building apart from the start house so if you guys see a keyboard make sure you do pick that thing up and go ahead and sell it guys because the keyboard is worth a lot what else is worth a lot well let me quickly get on into it now guys so pretty much i'm just looking down the list over here of different items okay so pretty much guys the um antique vase that is worth 12 now what is the antique vase what makes it different from the normal ones well this one is kind of like the greenish one over there guys so you're gonna want to look for the green vase um it looks like we've got a few zombies in here guys um i don't know if there's one of you i'm trying to see if i can find one it's not that that's just a normal bottle guys but um yes yeah, the antique vase over there you guys need to see if you can find one of those because they're worth 12 which is a good amount to be honest yeah not gonna lie guys that zombie just does not want to let us in okay what other what other items are worth quite a bit guys well um all of the food items are really just worth one bottle cap each which is not really the best guys um now apparently the saw blade this blade over here is apparently worth 90 i'm just looking at an image over here guys someone literally sold this for 90 guys which is kind of crazy um so yeah that saw blade over there you guys can sell that for 90 now what else can you guys go ahead and sell over here guys in the game well i'm gonna be showing you guys that right now so pretty much guys you can also go ahead and sell weapons so weapons guys are also gonna um sell for a decent amount guys um, a lot of the typical weapons just sell for one, but I'm going to be telling you guys the weapons that do not sell for one. So we have the pistol, that sells for five. We have the assault rifle, the AK-47, um, that sells for five. The pump shotgun sells for ten. Um, also, guys, the RPG only sells for one, so don't bother selling an RPG. The Mac-10 sells for five as well, which is quite interesting. So, yeah, just keep that in mind, guys. Now, what other things are there? 
I guess two well of course we have the car parts guys so I'm gonna be telling you what car parts sell for um, in the game over here guys so pretty much all car parts actually sell for one they just sell for one guys so if you got an engine not going to really be able to sell it for much because it literally just sells for one and i've just realized i've not even attached any wheels onto this m trailer that's not good but yeah guys the car parts they sell for one so pretty much the items that are worth are quite a bit is this so this saw blade thing guys it's honestly worth a lot um so make sure you guys do go ahead and i guess get your hands on one of these and sell them because they are worth a decent amount now what i recommend you guys do i recommend um to just stack up on a bunch of items of course i don't really have a weapon so i can't really leave that place um but stack up on a bunch of items then just go back to one of the stores and just sell them guys honestly though the one that you're probably gonna find the most often might be something like the radioactive barrels which actually sells for the most in the game pretty much guys um apart from like that saw blade which seemed to sell for more i don't know why it sells for so much it might have just been a little temporary glitch guys i mean we can kind of test that out but um yeah of course what you just do is go back to the stores over here guys drifting into the shop right over here um there let's let's quickly get back um a bit bit close at the shop guys um so yeah pretty much let's just park this up over here and we'll see how much this sells for guys i guess so let's quickly grab that and then we can put it over here and we can sell this yeah apparently that sells for one now it must have just been a little bit of a um must have just been a bit of like a, a glitch guys when the update first released so yeah but as you guys can see we can just place these down over here guys and they will go ahead and i guess um show you how much they sell for i guess guys now unfortunately we can't actually put these down here because of course we can't sell items well i mean we could maybe buy them then sell them but i don't know if that would exactly work let's go um uh dust storm as well right now sandstorm um but yeah guys essentially you're just gonna want to put them over here and sell them guys and that's pretty much all you guys need to know about how to go in and find the, the items that sell for the most guys that's all the items and how much to sell for inside of the game um if you guys were wondering so yeah guys, i think that's pretty much gonna be it for the video right now so i guess like and subscribe for more